To watch this recipe in Hindi, check the link in description box below and also subscribe to Rudala's cookbook Hindi channel. Hello everyone, I'm Rudala and once again welcome back to my channel. Today in this video we will see Andhra's special sweet snack recipe called as Gavalu which is also known as sweet shells. The shells are made with dough and are coated with either sugar or jaggery syrup to give that sweetness and flavored with green cardamom. Before starting this recipe, if you haven't subscribed my channel yet, then click on the red subscribe button and also click on the bell icon to get notification of my new uploads. So let's start cooking. To make the dough for shells, we need one cup of flour. You can make them using only all-purpose flour or you can use only wheat flour, but I'm going to use both in equal quantities. So I have taken half cup of wheat flour and half cup of all-purpose flour. We also need half teaspoon salt and two tablespoon clarified butter, that is ghee. To coat the shells, we need 200 grams of jaggery, which is also known as good. Instead of jaggery, you can also use sugar. We also need 1 fourth cup of water, half teaspoon green cardamom powder, that is elaichi powder, and oil for deep frying. We will start by making the dough. For that, in a large plate, take wheat flour, all-purpose flour, and salt. Mix them well. Add in ghee. Combine this ghee and flour very well. Mixing ghee into dry flour will give crunchy texture to the shells. Once this forms into crumbly mixture, add little water and bring this flour together to make a dough. The dough shouldn't be very soft nor too hard. It should be medium soft dough. Knead this dough well till it becomes smooth. Cover it and keep it aside for 20 to 30 minutes. After around 30 minutes, divide this dough into small portions. Roll each portion to make smooth round balls. All the balls are rolled out. Now we need to shape them. To shape them, take a ball of dough. Using a fork, press it to make it flat. Then using a finger, gently take it out and roll to curl it. Let's see one more time. Press the dough using fork. Curl the dough to remove from the fork. In this way, make all the shells. Next, we need to fry the shell. So, I have oil heating in kadai. To check, we will put a piece of dough in it. It is not rising up immediately, it is coming up slowly, so the oil is heated well. Now set the flame on medium and carefully put the shells in it. Fry these shells on medium flame. These shells that we made are thick, so we need to fry them in medium hot oil. Fry them till they become golden brown. Once they become golden brown, take them out on kitchen towel. In this way, I have fried all the shells. So next, we need to make jaggery syrup to coat them. For that, in another pan, take jaggery. Add 1 fourth cup water. Set the flame on high and cook it till jaggery melts completely. To check the consistency of syrup, I have taken a bowl of water. We will put some syrup in it. The syrup should form a soft ball. You can see the syrup has dissolved in water, so we need to cook it further. Again, we will check. Now 
Now you can see the syrup is coming together to form a soft ball. So this is the right consistency we need. As soon as you get this right consistency, immediately turn off the flame and add in cardamom powder. Mix it well. Add in fried shells. Mix them very well until each piece is well coated with the syrup. Remove the shells and spread it on a plate. Don't put them on top of each other. Separate each piece so that they won't stick to each other. They are not ready yet. You can see they are still sticky. Keep them aside till the jaggery sets completely. Some of them are already starting to set. This one has set completely. After the jaggery sets, you can store them in an airtight container and they will stay good for 10 to 15 days. So my dear viewers, do try this recipe and let me know your feedback in the comments below. And if you like this video, then give it a like, share it and don't forget to subscribe my channel for more yummy recipes. I will be back soon with a new recipe video. Till then, take care. Bye-bye.